off with, I'm going to use some MAC Prep and Prime. I just got a tiny little tester here, so um, might as well use a bit of it. She has really luminous skin, so I'm, ooh, so I'm going to use um, Bobbi Brown Skin Foundation. Then I'm taking my MAC Studio Finish Concealer in NW25. And I'm going to just use it under my eyes. Um, she doesn't... I, I'm not going to make it too powder because I, I don't think the look is very matte at all. It's quite glowy and dewy, kind of. So I'm going to use my MSF Natural. And I'm just going to powder from the middle of my face outwards. I'm going to start on the eyes and I'm actually using this e.l.f. duo eyeshadow cream which I didn't like before but then I just found that it's like the perfect co perfect colour um, for this look as a base and I'm using the lighter one here. Bring it into the tear dots here a tiny bit. Now the eyes, it's really really tricky these eyes actually because um, her eyes are very very glossy and um, but they're very very light and natural looking glossy, not like a dark rock glossy or anything. And I've never really come across a like cream coloured, I mean this is a cream coloured kind of you know cream eyeshadow but it's not glossy. So I'm going to try and recreate the glossy look but um, first I'm just going to try and get the colours right. So I'm going to use um, I'm going to use some Naked Lunch first and then I'm going to use some All That Glitters. And I'm using the Sigma brushes today. I think these Sigma brushes are really good quality actually. Um, this one is the, e uh, the eye shading brush E55. Alright so I'm going to use this more in the inner section here. Then I'm going to use some all that glitters all over the lid. I'm just going to go back with um, Naked Lunch and I'm going to bring it up a little bit at the front here. I'm going to use um, some Woodwinked, this one, and a tiny bit in a crease. The crease isn't very dark in this look, but um, there is a bit of colour in there. So I'm Naked Lunch again as my highlight. Is that um, cork underneath the eye? Just a little bit. Um, I could be wrong, but I think there's three look three makeup looks in this video. There's one where she's in a shop with Drake, there's one where she's got the purple eyeshadow on and I think it's different. The one um, where she's, it's kind of more like all mysterious looking and then she's like dancing with people in the dark or, and stuff. Um, I'm pretty sure they're three different looks but the first and the mysterious one is quite similar. I find it hard to tell the difference between the first and the third look, so I'm going to try and kind of combine them. So it's like, as you can see, like in the video, it's really natural, kind of glossy eye. I'm going to use some Naked Lunch in the tear duct, but underneath the lip here. In the waterline, I don't think it's that strong. Um, I don't think it's like a really harsh black line. So instead, um, I'm using a brown eye pencil from number seven, it's this one here. Now I'm gonna do my eyebrows and I'm using my Rimmel pencil and hazel. And actually her eyebrows, I think now she's got the really, really bright red hair and everything. Her makeup's a lot more toned down, I've I've noticed. Um, that's why I didn't do the Only Girl in the World tutorial because I thought it was so sim like it was so neutral that it wasn't even worth doing a tutorial on. Um, so I think now also like her eyebrows are very, very, very toned down. Like in the video they look 
just really natural. So I'm just going to like go over my eyebrows a little bit. Just to finish off with the glossiness of the eyes, um, I know that this is like a cheap way to do it. I'm going to just use some Vaseline. I'm going to dab some Vaseline on, on top of the eyeshadow. Um, I'm not sure if this will work or not, but I know this you can use Vaseline to, to create glossy eyes. So um, I'm just going to use a tiny bit on my finger. So hopefully there you can see the glossiness on the eye, which I feel like she has in the video. Her eyes are very, very glossy. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, right, now I'm going to do the eyelashes. Okay, I've had such a hard time trying to get these lashes on. I went through two different pairs because they just looked really bad. Um, they're still The glue's still drying on them if they look a bit dodgy. Um, and I've done a silly thing, actually. I forgot to put mascara on my eyelashes before I put the lashes on. So I'm using um, my Makeup Forever Smoky Lash Mascara. And I'm just going to try and coat my natural lashes a little bit. I put a bit of mascara on the bottom lashes as well. Uh, I don't think she has that much contour on in this video. I'm using my sleep contour kit. I'm just going to add a little bit just to give... I think she must have a little bit. <laughs> but just not a lot, so... Okay, um, and now I'm going to do some blush. And as I said before, like her face in this video is really, really luminous. So I'm using my um, cream blush in Lady Blush from Mac. Stabbing a little bit on the cheeks. She has like pinky, subtle pink cheeks. Powder blush. This is Fleur Power. I'm just using a tiny bit. Okay, now this is like one of my favourite products of the moment. It's the Illamasqua um, Cream Blusher in Lies. And it actually makes a really, really gorgeous highlight colour as well. But you can kind of use it for both, like blusher or highlighter. I'm just going to put a bit on the cheekbones. Her lips are quite neutral pinky, so I'm going to use Plink from MAC, which looks like this. Um, it's really sheer, and um, D-Light from MAC as well, lip gloss. Just to finish off, as you all know, I love my high beam from Benefit, <laughs> so I'm just going to use a tiny bit um, up on the brow bone because hers is um, quite highlighted as well. Tiny bit on the cheeks. And there is my Rihanna What's My Name um, makeup tutorial look. Um, I hope you like it. It looks like this. I hope you enjoyed it and um, I hope you love the song as much as I do. I love the song. Um, <laughs> and... Um, I might do the I might do the second look from the video, the purple eyes. So um, let me know if you want to see it, or I might have already filmed it, and it will be coming up for you guys because I really love the purple look as well. So um, yeah, I hope you like the look. Sorry if it's not exactly the same, but I tried to do like as similar as I could with trying to get the glossy eyes and all. Um, so yeah, have a lovely day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.